by connecting with Mr. Smith, you have to become one of his clients. You ever been investigated before? No, this is the first time. But your assignment would take you undercover and assist you in to help an apartment eliminate crime in the city. So what are we looking at? Does this assignment include getting rid of all drug dealers, pimps, prostitutes, scam artists? Now you're making sense, but not so fast. I have a plan. In order for you to begin cracking down on the crime in the streets, we need you to become part of the streets. We won't allow you to carry your ID, your gun, or your badge. You'll be out there for two months on your own. Will that give us enough time to uh, build cases against all these scumbags? I'm not expecting you to be Wonder Woman. I just want to clean up the city. No BSing. No citizen complaints. Do I make myself clear? Sure, Captain. I'll play by the rules. Take the rest of the day off. Cruise the streets, meet some people. Be ready to report for your assignment first thing in the morning. Good day. It's amazing when your shoe is on the other foot. Are you gonna let me in? Tell me what you need, Miss Bowers. I'll try to make it happen. <laughs> then I'll get to the point, Mr. James. I'm willing to pay you a whole lot of money to crack this case. I want results, Mr. James, not promises. I want whoever robbed my guest at my pool party brought to justice. Are we on the same page? Good. And um, one last question, Mr. James. Okay. Are you a married man? <laughs> no. Not if I can help it. Um, actually, I've been divorced for the past five years. And why do you ask? No, no, don't get alarmed. I, I just like to, um, as some may say, I like to know the people that work for me. Okay. Um, Mr. James, you're hired. Excellent. I'll get my assistant to give you all the paperwork you need to get the job started. Have a great day, Mr. James. Bye. I've given some thought about my late husband's insurance money. Look, Miss Davis, we don't have to go through this. Nonsense, let this woman talk. Being the Christian woman that I am, and out of the respect for my late husband, I'm willing to make you gold diggers an offer. Did you just call me and my daughter gold diggers? I didn't mean for it to be no insult. I'm calling it the way I see it. I thought that enough money would make all this hell mess go away. Well, let me get to the point. Here is a certified check for $10,000. Are you happy now? Why dare you come here and insult my child like this? Misty's not a charity case, and I certainly won't have you come here and insult her like this. That's my first and my final offer. You can take it or you can leave it. The humiliation that you put my child through is well worth more than $10,000. So you take your check and leave before I forget that I'm a Christian woman. So be it, Leanne. I'm out of your life. I don't want you and your nappy head daughter to stay out of mine. I won't go away, Miss Davis, until you accept the fact that part of me is a Davis. I'll see you in court. Thank God you came to your senses. If your intentions are to see the kids, you are wasting your time. They are not here. My kids? See, that's what I like about you, Margo. Now you're reading my mind. Why do we always have to go through this when it comes to our children? For starters, you're not a responsible father. And I have no love for a deadbeat dad. You don't watch the news, do you? Your Georgia state law says child support is determined by the income of both parents. You being a big time supermodel that you are and working in a place like this, I know you're making the mega bucks. So now, can we talk? Look, you have no idea what's going on in my life. From the looks of it, you're not complaining. Look, before
before we get to cutting each other's throats, can we talk about the situation at hand? For old time's sake, we have dinner with me tonight. I used to think that I wasn't fine enough, and I used to think that I wasn't wild enough, but I won't waste my time trying to figure out why you playing games, what's this all about, and I can't. Can you hold us for just one more day? I promise when I get back, I will show you double the attention. It all depends. Depends on what?